Robin, I want to go back to the Give It To You track, the one with 2 Chains and Kendrick Lamar. I got a chance to check it out. It's more of like an EDM style track. Yeah. And that's very different for Kendrick. Was it hard to get him to get into this sort of vibe? And you said he picked that one? No, the, 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 yeah, the funny thing is I had a couple records that I wanted him to consider, you know, because I just knew I wanted to work with him. I think he's the, the best lyricist uh, out there right now. And, uh, yeah, he picked that one. He loved the record, and 2 Chains loved it, too. And the funny thing was, I first, my management sent it to Kendrick, and he didn't cut it right away, and I didn't hear back. So then I sent it to 2 Chains, and 2 Chains mm -hmm. nailed it. And then about, like, uh, two weeks ago, nice. I got a, I, I, they sent me an email. They're like, these are Kendrick's vocals. I'm like, are you yeah. kidding me? Oh, Kendrick man. did his, Four. did it? So, hell of yeah. a problem to have, Yeah, man. hell of a problem. What yeah. you say, penthouse problems. Penthouse you like to go. problems. I try to remind myself that if I get too stressed that these are the best problems to have. I heard that, man. How's home plate, man? How does it feel to just have the most beautiful wife in the business and everybody Jeez. lets you know that? Well, she's, uh, you know, as you know, we've been together since we were teenagers. Yes, sir. You know what I mean? So... So uh, I'm very blessed, and she's also my best friend and my, uh, you know, inspiration and my muse and all that good. Do you stuff, run so. songs, Pastor? Sometimes oh yeah, get that, oh, that she, feel. She, she well, I run my scripts, Pastor, that I'm right. writing. I run, I run everything by her. She has an impeccable taste, and you know, because we've worked together for so long creatively, uh, we really can bounce off each other really well. So I'm I'm very lucky. She she fills every uh, nook and cranny that I can. And and watching with. just just house husbands alone, you you like very comfortable with guys saying how beautiful your wife is, as long as it's not crazy disrespectful. No, right? no, no. I mean, yeah, and le yeah, I, I'm fine with that. I think that I, my my line has always been when guys are like, "Hey, man, no disrespect, but uh, you know, you got a fine wife," and someone be like, "Hey, you got good taste, man." Right. Yeah. And does, she yeah. tastes good. Does she? Hello. Hey. hey does she? Does she? <laughs> she doesn't get upset when when women say the same about you. It kind of she gets jealous. We both get jealous, right. but it, but it turns her on too. Like right, you know right. what I mean? That's like she like she be like, she she sometimes she likes to put on the groupie hat. You know what I mean? And she'll just play my groupie for a minute, and that's that's a lot of fun. Oh, so y'all role play? Kinky turn on. Yeah, we like to role play. Who gets her, hit on more, you or her? Well, g girls are more scandalous, so I get hit on. More. <laughs> guys True. are guys are a little more respectful. They'll they'll slow play. You know, right, I mean? right, they'll right. wait until she gives them an end. Girls don't care. They just be like, I want "What it. you doing?" Right, <laughs> and they know who your wife is. Yeah. Oh, that you know, that's just even more of a reason. Like your wife is so beautiful. Can I suck your? <laughs> y'all stick around, y'all radios. We got Robin Thicke in the neighborhood. Big boy in the neighborhood. Big boy in the neighborhood. Robin Thicke is in the neighborhood. So you have Two Chains, Kendrick, Pharrell, and Tia in the album. And I heard that you were trying to get ASAP on the album. I was trying to get ASAP. Yeah, well, he he cut a verse on this one record, but uh, he didn't love the verse. And then the record didn't end up making the album. Oh. So. Is he gonna be on any other? Track? Sooner or later, I'm definitely gonna do something with ASAP because he's that. crazy. Yeah, yeah, that needs to happen. Oh man, a and in fact, when I heard ASAP's uh, album. Album, his first one, I was I wanted to make uh, some records like that because I just I think it's a whole new sound that he's created. So I try, I made this one um, ballad that sounds like an ASAP track, but yeah. with made it Robin Thicke vocals on it, and it's called Three because it's about three is the magic number. Oh. Trying to ask my girl to have a threesome Ooh, in, a very, uh, nice. in a very sensual, wow. loving way. Man. Would she say yes if you did ask? Me? I hear those threesomes are well. Good. You know, some things are uh, better left unsaid. <laughs> right, right. <laughs> But who would come and have the privilege of joining that right? threesome? Right? Yeah. You have to be super high. Like Already let's play a round of who's not invited to the threesome. <laughs> yeah. Oh, my All gosh. Right. We're going to play a round of who's not okay. invited to the yeah, threesome. Let's do that. Good. All righty. Snooki. Uh, Snooki is oh, not yeah. invited, bro, to <laughs> the threesome. Christina Aguilera. Best believe that. Christina, oh, Christina Aguilera, there you go. Not invited to the threesome. Your friend Oprah, she's not invited. Shoot. She'll come yes, to my wanna come. <laughs> With that money? I'm going to tell you straight up, man. Pays her Oprah, way in. you can come to my You can pay your way in. Yeah. Hell yeah. Be like, how much is it getting the threesome? <laughs> like, it's uh, a million dollars. <laughs> well, here's my million. <laughs> Million for everyone. You get a threesome. You, you get, get a threesome. You get a threesome. You get a threesome. Yeah. 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 Just believe that. My wife would be like, "Baby, oh are you coming gosh. over here?" I'm like, "Baby, just let me satisfy Oprah, please." Oh my like, god. Like, this way. Man, you, you, you know, get a threesome. You know what she could do for us? <laughs> this is life insurance. Brain. Yeah, I'm gonna tattoo her brain. Is that too much? All right, y'all stick around your radio, big boy neighborhood. Oh my god. Make sure we get an edit on that.